What's up? Welcome back. Today I'm here with my bot cousin. Hi. <laughs> and yeah, today I'm gonna be teaching him. I'm gonna be trying to teach him how to not be as big of a bot. He is on the same exact binds, the same, he even has the same strike pack as me, all the same controller settings. I think he even uses the same sensitivity as me. So mm -hmm. he has no disadvantages in that sense, but he is a little less experienced, I guess you could say. So to start off with, Ethan, what high ground retakes do you currently know? Your normal 90s, your normal start, more 90s, and just 90s. Look at this dude. We're gonna go for one fight and see what he knows. <laughs> Low ground shot. No, nope, that's not gonna work. Fast. Okay, that's enough. Just teach me your ways. <laughs> So probably the most basic one, I'm sitting here stuck low ground, you're up top, is literally just to turn around and start doing this and do some of those. And then at any point you can do this and you can turn back around and you can just start editing up and oh, editing that's bot cones. stuff. Yeah, okay. Already oh, looking like less of a lot. You just gotta, yeah. Make sure to do it behind you though, not just to your sides. Do it based on where I am. Hold on, like this, like that. No, behind you. Like do a complete 180, and then place it and turn around. Okay, hold on, real quick. What's your build sense? 2.7. What? 2.7 You were on Hello? a 2.7 build sense? Mm -hmm. What is wrong with you? Is that too high? Are you serious? <laughs> oh my god, Ethan Are you going mm -hmm. higher my actual sense too? It's all messed up Why would you go? No I'm on a 1.3. That is way too slow. Okay, Are you buddy. serious? Let's see you get height then. <laughs> I'm just saying right now, if you're on 2.7 sensitivity, you are going okay. to mess up every single build you do. So something that also changes build sensitivity is your actual normal sensitivity, like your look sensitivity. No. What's your look sensitivity? No. Yes, I swear to God it no, is. No, it does not. What's your, okay, what's it your look sensitivity? Not. Okay, you see where it says sensitivity? You see where it says use advanced options? Mm-hmm. Is that on or off? That is off. Honestly, you should have switched off Just... of legacy look controls like five months ago. Where There's do I go? no Carter, reason to legacy your ways. look controls anymore. <laughs> Come on. Ethan, I have like 14 settings videos. I don't watch your, your settings videos because those are kind of boring, I'm not going to lie. Okay. Where do I... What have I been doing wrong? It feels different. It might feel weird right now, but in like two days. Wow, you already look better. Okay, now that you have that figured out, uh, I'm confused how you Dude. get this far in Fortnite on Legacy. It's a horizontal. This, this one might be getting a little more advanced. Can you handle it? Oh, sure. It's simple, but it can be kind of hard to do. You place your stair, you place your floor cone, and you, okay, hold on, we're gonna ignore that part. You have a stair, you place your floor, your cone, and you go up and you side jump, land on top, right? Okay, but how do you do Let, that? Let's see it, you, you just, you do it. Uh, you, you almost had it. Almost like you're trying to jump like this and jump onto the top of that. Like jump oh, over yeah. and around. And instead of just jumping straight out, go and just go over and around and land on the backside edge. What the f was that? <laughs> you're still trying to just jump out like this. This is hard to do. Go up like you're hugging the right side and jump out and then pull your analog stick back like you're trying to land back on top of the pyramid. Boom. Right? <laughs> I just did it. Now when you get a little more advanced with it, you can start throwing it into doubles instead of just doing singles. 
Hey. That gets height like literally every time. So still face outwards, but pull your analog stick back when you're in the air. And then place the floor stair. Once you perfect like your positioning and your jump and timing and stuff, you won't really need to pull back because you'll literally land like right on top of it and you can just keep running. Like there's no interruption. Boom. Just like that. Like this. And then look, a lot of times from there, and this I get hide on you almost every time. From there, I go like this a lot. And then I just turn up and do a 180-90. Try that. Do that. Okay, so like this. Going up. Alright. <laughs> Alright. Then you do a side jump, and then as soon as you do that, you turn around. Don't even do like a normal 90, just turn around and do a full 180. Here. Boom. Boom. Wow. I don't know if I should be teaching you these. Why? So let's try it again. Let's try you're, it again. Gonna, you're gonna be actually decent in our 1v1s, but I still think it's better than me having to 1v2 all of our duo matches, so... Oh my god. You're insane, Jarvis! Look at that. You might actually be able to kill someone in squads or duos or something now. When you get to double and you get comfortable with double, you can start adding walls. Dude, there's no I'm still not even very good at doing the walls, but... I just want to get to double one. Should we try it in a fight? Just use it whenever you get low ground. And we all know that's gonna happen. Oh, uh, I'm trying to get this. Well, here, it just takes here, practicing. Here. I literally do this like pretty much every day. Dude, it's like every time I want to get it, I don't get it, but then. Well, then just don't want to get it. Yeah, that's the thing, it's so versatile, like you literally, if you get stuck under a floor, like it's the best way, instead of going like this and building out, it's so much quicker just to do this. You can use it during any instance in a fight. You wanna know a funny what? thing? I use it to get height at the start of every single one of our 1v1s. Okay, instead of taking those dumb low ground shots, I actually try to do that. Do a little retake. This whole building thing is freaked up. Try to use it. Boom. See that? You would have got height if you did it right. Five. <laughs> ha, I used it too. I still got height, but. He's got height now, huh? Huh, buddy? This is where I need to get cocky. You want to know one more? It's really simple, not nearly as hard as that one. Look, you want to see it? You watching? Yes. It's literally a high build 90. When you go up, instead of just building these, build the next two up, and then when you go, place a floor, and you can edit through both of these. What do you mean, if I think you can do it? It's so easy. I can't do the double edit. You can't do a double edit? Uh -uh. So you're telling me you can't do this? Uh -uh. Well, we might have some issues then. See, they're it, like it, keep practicing my wall right now. Okay, go. Why do you even have a wall up? You can't double edit. I, why, why are you trying to triple edit? <laughs> All right, just just try this high build ninety. Just build up two high nineties. Okay, you want the there. wall? No, you want the wall on this side. You don't have a wall over there. And then once you do that, that is so useful in a fight. Like I use it against you all the time. 
I'll be doing the first move and then I'll turn and I'll do a double high build like that. I'll place my stair and then I'll edit back up through it and I'll just start ramping at you like this. Yeah. Now you that gotta build it. fight me and you got to know how to do all of them. You gotta know how to incorporate all of them into your build battles. Oh, oh, Carter, Carter, I just did the double edit. <laughs> Let's go. I did that double edit, man. I did that that <laughs> that big 90 thing and then double edit with the Good with stuff. the floor. It's mm -hmm. useful in fights too when you use it in the right positioning. Speaking of positioning, for those of you watching, would you guys like to see this turned into a little series? I could do a part two based on like positioning or aim or something, anything like that. If you have some suggestions of what I should teach my bot cousin next, let me know down in the comments below. No way. <laughs> okay, I'm done. Okay. Feel like you learned okay. anything? Yeah. How that was little today's side session? Job. Like it? It was pretty good. Think you're gonna yeah. use them? Heck yeah. Down for a little part two about something else. Maybe more builds, maybe something else. Aiming. Aiming? I'm down. Yeah. All right, so that's gonna be the end of that one. That was a super fun video to record, and I honestly think it was pretty valuable to him. I definitely think he improved just in that hour or so session that we had, and I know that he's gonna continue to practice those moves and improve upon them. And yeah, I had a good time teaching him. I hope you guys had a good time watching. As always, don't forget to like and subscribe, and that's the end. I hope to see you guys in my next video. I need help. Nuts. I just killed them both with one <laughs> How pistol. How did you round. do that? How did you do that? <laughs>